I want to bring you to my hometown, Bordeaux. What a vast subject when talking about wine, right? But I'm not gonna go through the well-known left and right banks. I'm gonna stick right in the middle, the Entre-deux-Mer. Some people are not necessarily aware of the 15 appellations that constitute the Entre-deux-Mer as a whole. Because the most well-known of them is actually the one which bears the name of the region itself, reputed for its dry and lively white wines. But there is a great variety of soils and subsoils over there that provides a diversity of terroir very favorable for the production of great red wines. Let's take the example of Chateau Marjos, a historical property built in 1782, just south to Saint-Emilion in Bordeaux. The 65 hectares of vineyards are surrounded by forests and the biodiversity is carefully preserved. Pierre Lurton, from the family Lurton, one of the largest wine dynasties in the world, was born and raised in a neighboring chateau and bought the Chateau Marjos piece by piece starting from 1991 and renovated the old stone house which is now his home. Yes, he was enchanted by the location of this beautiful estate and the character of the Grésillac terroir. When I first came to Chateau Marjos in 2019, it's not only the busy and brilliant manager of the prestigious classified growth Chateau Cheval Blanc and Chateau Diquem that I met. Pierre Lurton is first and foremost a wine grower, a father and a man of integrity who loves his terroir and would literally spend hours by the fireplace with a glass of wine sharing fascinating anecdotes about his secret garden. And believe me, we can feel this tremendous passion in the wines of Chateau Marjos. Let's taste! Chateau Marjos White 2016 is a blend of 45% Sémillon, 45% Sauvignon Blanc and 10% Muscadel. It's a wine that has been aged on leaves for two months in cement vats before being bottled. It shows a beautiful pale gold color, typical of Bordeaux White. It smells honeysuckle and white peaches, very delicate notes of citrus. On the palate, it has a rich flavors of pears, and stone fruits. This wine is very lively and fresh while being a little bit fat. It actually manages to, to be a full body white that retains a backbone of acidity. It's really well balanced. Chateau Marjas Red 2015 is a blend also of 80% Merlot, 10% Cabernet Sauvignon, 10% Cabernet Franc. It's a wine that has been aged for 12 months in oak barrels. Whoa, it smells candied fruits like cherries, blueberries, blackberries and very elegant toasted oak notes. This wine is very velvety and supple. It shows lots of fruits and sits on a very beautiful acidity and elegant tasty tannins. This is a wine that is drinkable right now but has a great potential of aging. So while applying his classified growth expertise, Pierre Lurton has made here a very personal and signature wine. Cheers!